la baba wa bulae hi hello hello beauty queens and beauty kings this is la beauty queen anna and i hope you guys are doing great today if you are new welcome back to my channel i hope you hit that subscribe button right on your right and if you are a returner i want to say thank you for the support <laughs> And I got a big head, I'm blessed. And today we're gonna do a quick review. I'm just gonna review one product which I feel was popular. So the product I'm gonna review today is by Pearl Cosmetics. When I saw this product, I was like, wow, this is gonna be great because it's fun. It has a bunch of nice colors and I've been getting a lot of Pearl Cosmetics products and they've been okay so far. So I thought, hmm. This seems a little bit exciting, you know, why not try this? And the price was affordable. And this also relates to a movie. So I was like, all right, let me support the whole theme. So it's none other than this, My Little Pony, the movie eyeshadow palette. When I saw this, I was like, wow, $29. It has a lot of colors, it's out there. It has all the colors I would possibly need. It's affordable. Pearl Cosmetic has been doing me right so far, so I thought, why not? That is the packaging, and then in the back, you get the names of the eyeshadow. In the hearts there, you get this white packaging, which is actually very, very inconvenient if you're doing makeup, especially if you're rushing. This will get dirty in no time. So this right here, no bueno. It is like cardboard paper. As you open it, you get a real nice size mirror as shown right here. And then this flips back, which is pretty cool. So it can stand as such. Guys, aren't these colors so beautiful? You also get a little covering right here, which we don't need. Guys, aren't these all the colors you need in your life i was so excited like i like warm tones but i do like to have pops of color here and there so i thought this would be a perfect perfect palette i will tell you i already swatched this and i was highly disappointed most of the shadows are powdery they are not opaque there are only a few that are actually good which is not worth it because i wanted this to work if a palette has a lot of fails it has to go back to the store so i'm going to show you the swatches right here and i'll come back and tell you guys what i think about this palette i have not even use it on my eyes yet I just wanted to really come at you guys and give you a review on this if you were thinking of buying this now I do like that they had the names in front I don't know if you guys can see that but they do have the names of the eyeshadows I'm gonna start with the first row so we're gonna do kindness it is actually very chalky can you guys see that extremely chalky I'm gonna go in with flutter shy oh my look at that guys very very light i mean shutterfly is okay it's a little buttery it's not as powdery but still go in with generosity right here and i am really trying here you can barely see generosity so white right here rarity again i am really really trying you see how chalky and how there is a lack of opacity it's really really inconvenient i'm not look at that i'm gonna go in the second row with this applejack gold it's not bad this, the applejack is not bad honesty right here honesty it's not bad now i'm gonna do laughter can you see the powder coming off like it's just so bad like i just can't guys look at that very chalky that's laughter very chalky i oh oh my god this is awful with pinky pinkie pie right here very bright color but let's see oh the powder is even falling off of oh my goodness guys look at that powder everywhere we're gonna go to the third row right here this pink twilight sparkle very sparkly the color shows on there not bad it's not chalky like the other ones the purple magic I'm running out of space there. That is magic. Not bad, not bad. Rainbow Dash right here. I'm really trying to get it out for you guys. Very, 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 very vibrant. This is not as chalky as the other ones either. Loyalty. The green is also good. Not as chalky. It's doable. Now we're going to get into the last row. We're going to start with 
Tempest shadow. It's not as opaque, but it's not powdery like the other ones either. Songbird. This is a little bit chalky. I'm not really liking that. Storm King. Okay, Storm King is also good. It's not bad. Storm King is not bad. There's no powder. Last, we're gonna do Princess Sky Star. So this is Princess Sky Star on top. So and then we're gonna go all the way down. So as you can see, it has a great range of colors. They're beautiful colors. However, however, the quality is not great. The pigmentation is there, but the opacity is not there, and then it's very chalky, and so which makes it hard to blend. And to build the color, it would take a lot of time. So I am not excited about this product at all, as you can see. I am not like bubbly about it. So of course, I do not recommend it for $29. Of course, I used the coupon because Ulta was having a sale. But I wanted to bring it to you guys and show you live that these swatches may look so pigmented. However, the quality is not up to par. There were only a few colors that I would say could work, but I don't think it's worth it for those couple of eyeshadows. I do not recommend this palette. If you like this palette, please comment down below on tips on how you use it. Maybe I can see and maybe others can try it for themselves. But that is my take. It's only my opinion. Please take it with a grain of salt and try it at your own risk so if you did buy it I hope you do like it and even if you don't there's always other alternatives that are even cheaper that you can always use so there you go for that and this palette is available right now online only at alta.com but I think it'll be available in stores August 31st so thank you again so much for watching don't forget to always praise the God that you serve don't forget to always check out my recent uploads Click the like button, share and comment. I would love to hear from you guys. Let's grow this community and let's share ideas and thoughts because when we're sharing, we're winning together. Donc, salut à tous, salut les beauty king et beauty queen. Je vous ai montré, montré ces palettes. Pearl Cosmetics a fait un, une palette en fonction du film My Little Pony. Donc euh, j'ai vu les couleurs, j'étais vraiment intéressée, mais Je vous assure que la formule n'est pas bonne. La pigmentation est là, mais là, il y a trop de poudre qui, qui sort. C'est pas facile à travailler. Et je trouve que c'est trop inconvénient. Donc, je ne recommande pas cette palette. Mais si vous êtes intéressé et si vous aimez et si ça marche avec vous, je vous invite à faire les commentaires sur la barre d'infos pour nous donner des conseils. Donc, on ne sait jamais. Le moment, je me dis, je vais retourner cette palette à la boutique parce que c'est Même comme les couleurs sont très jolies, la pigmentation est là, mais cette formule n'est pas bonne, pas du tout. Donc il faut vraiment travailler, c'est faire à paupières, puis il y a trop de poudre, et puis euh, voilà, je n'aime pas trop. Quand je disais, je ne recommande pas. Vous pouvez trouver euh, ce produit en ligne sur orta.com, et puis euh, ça sera aussi euh, dans les boutiques le 31 où tu penses bien. Donc voilà, euh, n'oubliez pas surtout de beaucoup prier, et aussi de faire les commentaires sous la barre d'infos, et de voir mes vidéos récentes, mettre les pouces en l'air, et on se voit à la prochaine, et surtout n'oubliez pas de partager les vidéos. Merci encore énormément d'être là pour moi et on se voit à la prochaine ciao bye bye so when they put you to the test just do your best and let god do the rest and enemies stress i'm a living witness i'm the proof nothing is impossible and that's the truth you can achieve if you plan to if i can make it man you can too